So are these your samples? Yeah. A generator. Ah, okay. So it all starts this end. Yeah, that starts. That's the that's a that's a um, uh, our cutting mill. So it's like a shredder. Yeah, it's kind of a shredder, but uh, yeah, it's a it's smaller and okay. Um, at this point, so we are shredding the, the materials, the input materials. Then it gets stored in this uh, silo. It's like a big hopper, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, so when it shreds it, is it uh, is it being sucked like a vacuum or something uh, into into that hopper? Um, blown yeah. in there? Yeah, yeah, it's blown in there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And this plastic here that you're using is this? Uh, what what sort of plastic is this? Is it, does this have uh, no PVC? Yeah, no. Yeah. No PP. What? what it's it's or, only PP and PE and the and and some. Uh, and some other materials, they are no problem, like light. Like so, this, this is multi layer kinda, plastic? Yeah, that's the multi layer, that's a kind of uh, it's a PP and the and the aluminium, yeah, 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 construction and yeah, some. So, that's okay for our plant, yeah, that's okay, that's okay to work in our plant, and so it don't need to be. Uh, How does clean. it deal with the multi layer? Does it, uh, it it processes that without any problem? Yeah, yeah, okay. Perfectly. Uh, okay. the, the, the uh, system works in, in, in this way that it's uh, just pearlized the plastic and the uh, other stuff and, and, and the other materials keeps over so uh, okay yeah and so it is not it's it, it's not a problem if it's a, a multi-layer or if there are some some other things like soil or uh, paper uh, uh, labels or things yeah. like that that's not a problem for not our a plan. okay okay so that's that's a different uh, be between our plant and the normal recycling where everything needs to be clean and in the same color so we are able to work with everything the only thing we have is uh, our plant is uh, is uh, built for PE and PP if there are some some small uh, other uh, plastic materials inside like um, um, PET for for um, about ten percent, it's possible. So I'm not quite sure. So so, so we have kind of so, so we have a white list where you can see what you can put in, and we have a black list and which shows you um, in which uh, which amount is uh, is uh, okay for our plan for other materials kind of PET or some glue. So so if if we have some uh, plastic, uh, which is so we are working with a company in uh, Flensburg. It's a uh, Sure Star. It's a flexible packaging company, and I have a, um, a multi-layer plastic. So it's PE, uh, PEU glue, and uh, uh, PET. Uh, yeah. Now what is this word? Um, yeah, and, and a little bit of, of, of PET of about 10%. So that's okay for our plant. Okay. <coughs> yeah. I hope you get the information that the plant isn't running today. Okay. Yeah. Of course, we are uh, in the next days, they will leave to Flensburg again to our partner. So the, the, the plant runs there in a, in a, in a, in a, in a real area, so uh, at our uh, partner Shorestar, and now it's. So here it goes from here, and then it goes here. into this yeah. feeder, okay, yeah. and from here it it gets all ready heated on at, at, at this place, just to okay, see, just that that you get kind of a, a plastic sausage, <laughs> okay, and it's uh, respond uh, it's. It's um, the 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 point where we uh, get the vacuum by the by the plastic okay. sausage, yeah, and that's and, and then it goes this this way, it goes through the reactor, get it heated up to five hundred degrees, mm -hmm. and at this point uh, it goes in a gas stadium, yeah, and then we have these cooling points where we cool it up and get it back into a fluid. Uh, 
a house of water and for a fluid um like a wax uh, yeah that's not that yeah it's, yeah like wax uh, but yeah and a fluid a fluid um part a stadia uh, state of of the of the uh, material so it gets fluid th what isn't vapor does it go, go down into uh, that's into the vapor? that's the uh, residue so that's at like this the point carbon, we collect carbon, uh, carbon black. black and and, okay. and all the materials okay. they didn't get uh, in, okay. in, in into the gas stadium. M maybe some metal or something yeah, like if, that. Okay. If you have some metal, metal. inside, uh, yeah. uh, if you have kind of, uh, for for example aluminium, uh, yeah. and and any of the uh, the gas that's not. Uh, Processed no, into oil uh, goes into the uh, in, in into a journey on the uh, ah, not, so uh, not a journey but a but a flame yeah uh, okay. Okay, and then At this, this is the output. But, but this is just our solution for the gas in the next stadium. So so, uh, so, so it's 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 heated with electricity. Yeah. Okay. And. Uh, Okay, and so the gas comes, I understand that. Um, and at this point, so, so we have two, uh, two cooling points. The first one gets the fluids out. Yes. And the second one gets the wax. So, but our process is focused at the wax. So, so, uh, so we have the option to uh, handle it that we have more fluid and the less amount of wax, but it will uh, have an, 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 an increase on the uh, quality of the wax. At the moment we are producing a good quality wax. So what percentage uh, uh, is oil and what percentage <coughs> is wax? How does that... It's, it, it, it depends how he runs the plant. So and it depends so on, so, so on the, the moment, input, I guess? Just a, we have just a very, very, very small amount of, of oil and a high amount of, of wax. I think at the moment it's nearly... Martin? Uh, 70% is a wax and uh, about 30% is oil. Okay. At the moment. And, and the about 20% is... Uh, is a uh, gas at okay. the moment and it always depends on the input material about at, at the moment we have a two to five percent as a residue a kind of ash okay all right okay so two percent there thirty percent up twenty a uh, twenty percent up there uh into the oil yeah that's the that's the uh, storage for the wax and the ah that's for the wax yeah. and, and the other one is for the oil and the oil. And what sort of quality of oil is that? Is that oil that can be used for, is it that sort of a kerosene? No. No? Is it a, a, th a, th a, th a thick marine oil? What yeah, sort of it's more a marine oil. A thick oil. marine oil. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Into our generator producer. So, just, so, <coughs> so, so you can take the wax, you can heat it to heat it, yeah. 30 to 40 degrees, yes. and then you can use that use to it, run uh, a generator. Yeah, yeah. So you can use that for running uh, for electric, elect yeah. electricity yeah. with a special and generator. Yeah, it's and, 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 the, and, the, and the, the heavy <coughs> oil, I think I can call it that. Mm -hmm. uh, you can use for well, maybe you can also use that for running generation. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. So all the output can be used yeah, for yeah. generation. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Looking at taking the wax oil and then putting that back into into the plastic. Uh, it would be the best way. It would oil. Yeah. 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 And what was it? To Who'd use it as a raw material, not for energy production, to use it as a raw material for whatever. Yeah, that's the wax. Yeah, yeah. And the, the, the oil. Yeah. And so just remind me again, what percentage of heavy oil is it that's coming out? 70. 70. 70% 70 of wax and 70 30% of oil. 30%. 70 and 30. Okay. Yeah. doing some new things putting this one to this and trying this and I I think this one is but this is capable of 150 250 kilograms a day 250 kilos a day yeah that's and a small one and this is only a plan for a presentation and to have a sample plant so it's 
it's quite hard to get it in an economical uh, to, to, to run it in an economical way it's so on top of this you would need the uh, uh, the, f the facility to shred the plastic shred the plastic input the plastic yeah, yeah. So, uh, so yeah and then you you have to uh, uh, and the heat the, to heat this is this also electric yeah yeah this, this one is electric as well okay okay but it's always possible to get Yeah. Yeah. And this one is only for presentation things. Okay. It's, it's quite hard to get it in an economical way with two hundred fifty kilograms. It's just kilograms a showcase. A day. Yeah. It's a yeah. showcase. It's a. Yeah. It's a showcase to show everyone it works. Yeah. Got you. We have. We put less energy in than we get out, and the process works and everything, and the the economic version or the the the, the, the plan for for real production starts with one thousand kilograms a day. And then you have uh, the option to um, to add some uh, expansions for, uh, with the amount of 1,000 kilograms as well. So it's, it's, it's possible to put four expansions on this plant. Then you have about the amount of five tons a day. And that's a, that's a case you can earn money with. Hi. This is Okay. This is quite dirty. Um, this one, is, as you can see, a little oily. And um, this is uh, this better one. I just try to dig a little, so uh, you can okay. see. Oh, yeah, it's like a. a real yeah, this is where it where it looks like. A yeah, soft right. This wax. Is, yeah, soft wax. Um, with but this with liquid at what 20, 30, 40 degrees. 40, 40 degrees. Soft wax for soft skin. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what it is. <laughs> yeah, um, at forty degrees, around about. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this one here. Lovely. Yeah. So it, it, it quite much comes uh, as we talked about before for the MGO for the for the marine de uh, marine gas oils. So this is quite uh, quite what 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 this is like sort of special specification. So very good. Interesting. Yeah. So this is the the waxy fraction. We also have a little bit of oily fraction, but we sample here right now. That's not possible. Yeah. Work for that. But it, well, at least it's just oil. It smells a little, a little more. Yeah. We we do have uh, filter systems like from uh, from car engines. So the um, the oil and the wax also is already filtered, so it can go into an engine it's fine enough. There's no no um, content of of uh, any any little pieces or yeah, bits. Yeah, right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So and we also have before the the engine filters, we have a um, um, moving filter, um, centrifuge, um, centrifuge kind of filter. Yeah, yeah, yeah right. Yeah. Exactly, which is um, yeah. right down below. Okay. Right there. Yeah. Got gotcha. you. Very good. Exactly. So. Uh, just remind me, what's uh, this? What's this element of the system this, here? Uh, low temperature condensation unit. So this okay. is where. Um, when, the, when the hot wax gas comes out. from the reactor, this is yeah. the separator where, yeah. where the, the hot gas and the yeah. ashes and yeah. all the other... Yeah, the carbon um, black. Yeah, right. Yeah. Are get separated yeah. from that on goes yeah. over to the high temperature uh, condensation yeah. unit where the wax is getting condensated out. Okay. Uh, and afterwards the rest, or which is still in gas, Phase comes, comes for the lighter low temperature, low for the lighter oil right exactly and this is where we condensate it out at like 15 to 20 degrees yeah and which uh, the, the part which is still not not uh, liquid at that time yeah. goes up to the flare or in the real case yeah uh, we use a, um, a gas gen set yeah. to use it for yeah. ejector to, use to which heat. makes the most sense of to heat. and uh, so you're heating Mm -hmm. And and then are you are you then cooling yeah. here yeah. as well? This, so is, this is actively cooled. That's cool. Yeah. Ah, so that's like a, a, a an air con a, a yeah, refrigeration. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, this is over here. Yeah. This is the cooling unit. Ah, yeah, okay, I see. It. Yeah. We can set the temperature and uh, normally we run it at about twenty to fifty degrees Celsius. Okay. Celsius. Okay. Um, I, I the got cooling unit puts yeah. down the. Uh, yeah. The, the, the two hot gas in here. There's yeah. like a um, yeah, 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 yeah. condensation unit, and it like also c cools for the uh, for the wax as well. Um, yep. Yeah. A little. Just okay. For 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 better temperature. Um, okay. Perfect. Yeah. But the then abgezogen.
oil or wasted heating oil. Okay, so this is the storage, yeah, yeah. It's a storage tank and then goes through the pipes. Yeah. It goes. That's our next one. So this, I can show you it later. Oh, I just oh, okay. short loop. So we have two different, uh, this, our, this is our first version of the blend. Okay. It's a one ton a day blend. This blend is able to produce one ton a day. And this one is able, on the outside, it's able to produce what I tell you, two and a half tons a day. Okay. And this one is only able to work with heating oil. And our next versions are able as well to work with uh, waste oil. Yeah, so, so, so we started with heating oil because it's easier to clean heating oil. It's, it's, it's not easier to work with the heating oil. It's easier to handle the product uh, of, of heating oil because we're always getting out the diesel or uh, gas oil. Ah, and I so, can see... And it's the same. I, uh, it's, it's, it's not the same, but it's, uh, it's close. It's, so, so that's the storage tank for the uh, heating oil okay. from this there are the pipes it runs into the blend and then it starts here get heated so it's filled in in this yeah. thing it gets heated and then distillation and then you have all those rectification points where we cool it up and getting another uh, another or a different types or different uh, different yeah, types of our product and that's that's what we need to handle what 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 is the right temperature what is the right point to to get the best uh, quality of the product